Finally, we've won a game, and finally, Newcastle are back, bro. It's been a while since the A-League has been played, but we are back, and the Jets are back with a bang, bro. 2-1 win away from home at Sydney FC, and Costa Petratos, oh my god, he's come on with like 20 minutes to go, all guns blazing, he's, he's going around the place just kicking the ball to, I don't know what I'm saying, but like, for real, he's come on with so much energy, and he scored in the 91st minute to, to you know, he, he stopped Sydney from winning the Premiership. They will win it, obviously, but if they even got a point tonight, they would have won the Premiership. So, props to Costa Petrados. When he came on, I'm like, he won't do much, and then he goes and scores the winner. Scenes, absolute scenes. I thought when Dimi and Arroyo came on, they were all right. Ledley was all right. Um, I'm just talking about subs. Hoffman was pretty pretty poor. Didn't really do much, but he was pretty poor. Um, I'd say that Miller was one of our best players today. He he was very consistent, really good in the right at the right-back spot in the first half. Bit of a quiet one in the second half, although he did pick up an assist for that incredible Fitzgerald goal. Fitzgerald still had a pretty average game. He wasn't bad, but he wasn't exactly good either. I think he, he did okay, but that bicycle, man, automatically gets him from a 5 for a 6 to a, an, a 7 or an 8, bro. That bicycle, oh, amazing from Fitzgerald. Great goal. After going 1-0 down to a Caceres goal, Sydney were doing so good. Before they scored, and then we were we it was a bit end to end, but we were on top. Let's be honest, we were on top. I think Retre was incredible tonight, absolutely man of the match. But in terms of a Newcastle man of the match, I give it to Topper Nikolai Topper Stanley held our defense together tonight. Katrombus was here and there, good and bad. Um, Bogard was pretty awful to be honest. Um, I think O'Toole did well at left back. Real, real, real shame that uh, Bobby Burns has gone back to Hearts. I would have loved to keep him. He was, I think, our best player until he left, which was a shame. Oh, uh, oh by the way, Houlihan won't be coming back um, at this rate either. So that's great, isn't it? But yeah, so I'm pretty sure that that was probably the best we could have done tonight. Sydney FC have been almost flawless this season. They have been the best team throughout the campaign. They needed a point tonight to clinch the Premiership, and we've gone and beaten them 2-1 in the last minute through a Youth Academy Costa Petratos player goal. I don't know what I'm saying either. I'm going to get my words jumbled up. I went crazy when that goal went in. Uh, I tried to do a live stream on it, but no one wanted to watch it, so I just thought, why, why, why bother, you know? Um, anyway... I'm just happy that we've won 2-1. Again, so good that we're we're back. Um, you know, there's not much really to, to say. You know, this is just this has just been a great night in general for Newcastle fans. Um, Roy O'Donovan should have scored that chance in the first half. I know Redmayne did well, but I mean come on, he's gotta finish that, uh, O'Donovan. But you know what? We won the game, so I cannot really complain. I think Ibini was really good on the ball tonight. I think some of his runs, though, were just a bit strange, like in terms of positional runs, making an option, you know what I mean? Um, but what does this mean for Newcastle? We are three points off of a finals position. I w uh, we won't get it. We won't be in the finals. We'll bottle it. But um, who knows? We, we might. We might. We just might. There is a chance. There is a big chance. But we won't, unfortunately. Anyway, um... Western United might be getting top six. That's insane, isn't it, bro? Um, I don't know really if we have to bring anyone in. I think all Carl needs to do is 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 get us to be more clinical, work on our finishing, work on our chance taking. You know, get us to yeah take our chances. As I said, like nothing else really needs to be done. We <coughs> excuse me, we just need to take our chances, and we will be. A complete team, really. But no, I think Sydney will go on next season to clinch the title. I think that, yeah, again, I think they're just going to win the Premiership because they are the best team. They are. They, they are comfortably the best team. 
Um, but yeah, I know this video hasn't been too in-depth, but that's really all I wanted to talk about. We are finally back. Football is finally back. One last thing. We're not back in form, you know. Um, a lot of Newcastle fans are going to be like, you know, quarantine's changed us. We're back. We're a new, different team, all that sort of stuff. No, nah, mate. We're, we're not a different team. We're not back, you know, Newcastle of old's back or whatever like that. We are... Simply returning to the season, it will still end underwhelmingly. Um, and you can call me negative all you want, but I'm just a realist at the end of the day. So, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little review. There'll be more in depth as the season progresses. Um, but I am so so happy we have finally won a game, and since the football is finally back, what a way to start it as well. So, um, yeah, that's my thoughts on that. I hope you guys enjoyed once again. Please leave a like and subscribe. Leave a comment for what you want to see on the channel. But until next time, I'll see you in the next video.